हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द वेट ऑफ अ प्लेट सो बेसिकली आई विल एक्सप्लेन विद द हेल्प ऑफ अ कार्बन स्टील प्लेट फर्स्ट आई विल कैलकुलेट द वेट ऑफ अ कार्बन स्टील प्लेट देन आई विल एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू कैलकुलेट द वेट ऑफ एल्यूमिनियम और स्टेनलेस स्टील और टिटेनियम प्लेट्स सो लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड सी द बेसिक फॉर्मूला फॉर कैलकुलेटिंग द वेट इज वेट इज इक्वल टू V into rho. V is the volume, volume of the material of which we have to calculate the weight, and rho is the density, density of that material. So this is the basic formula for calculating the weight, and so. here i am having a diagram of a plate length of this plate is l width of the plate is w and thickness of the plate is t so suppose if we have to ca calculate the weight of any plate then first we should know the volume of that plate then the rho rho that is the density of that material so density of carbon steel i am writing in short density of carbon steel is 7850 kg per meter cube so this is the density of carbon steel now we have the density we know the density if we we will be able to calculate the volume then the volume will be multiplied by the density and we can calculate the or we can determine the weight so we volume of any plate is calculated by multiplying the length into length width and thickness so if you multiply the length width and thickness of any plate you will get the volume so for example here length is denoted by l width is denoted by w and thickness is denoted by t so if you calculate uh, multiply length width and thickness then you will get the volume so after getting the volume you have to simply multiply that volume with the rho in case of carbon steel rho is 7850 means if you multiply volume into 7850 you will get the weight of that plate now we'll understand with the help of a example so we will take the example we'll assume length of a plate as 1 meter width of a plate as 1 meter and then we'll calculate the weight so we'll take length 1 meter width 1 meter and thickness we'll take as 50 mm so this is the scenario Length is one meter, width is one meter, and thickness is fifty mm. And we have to calculate the weight of this plate. So first, we'll convert fifty mm into meter. See, these two length and width is given in meters. We have to convert thickness also in meter. So fifty mm can be divided by thousand to obtain the meter value. So fifty divided by thousand will be zero point zero five. meter so now we have all the dimensions in meter length is 1 meter width is 1 meter and thickness is 0.0.05 meter hence we can calculate volume very easily formula for calculating the volume is length into width into thickness so we will put all the values length is 1 meter width is 1 meter and thickness is 0.05 so after solving this we will get 1 into 1 into 0.05 will be 0.05 so after calculating 1 into 1 into 0.5 the value which will obtain is 0.05 and unit of volume will be meter cube why it will be meter cube because this one is in meter this one is in meter and the 0.05 is also in meter so meter into meter into meti meter will be meter cube hence now we have the volume volume of this plate is 
0.05 meter to get the weight we have to simply multiply the volume with rho as i told you earlier rho is 7850 since we'll put the values the volume which we have got is 0.05 and we'll multiply the volume with the rho rho is 7850 rho is 7850 for carbon steel so after multiplying these two values we will get 392.5 so the weight of this steel plate is 392.5 and unit is kg hence weight of a 1 meter length and 1 meter width and thick 50 mm thickness plate will be 392.5 kg so this is how we can calculate the weight now as i told you earlier that after calculating the weight of a carbon steel plate i will explain how to calculate the weight of aluminium or stainless steel or titanium or inconel or nickel plate see for other material plate also simply we have to determine the volume just by multiplying length width and thickness for any material plate you have to you have to calculate the volume by multiplying its length width and thickness and after multiplying length width and thickness the volume you will get the volume and you have to multiply this volume with rho that is density the density of the material will change for example for carbon steel i told you earlier that it will be 7850 now i'll write the density of other materials like for carbon steel the density i told you earlier for carbon steel the density will be 7850 and unit is kg per meter cube for other materials like stainless steel the density will be 8000 8000 kg per meter cube for aluminium the density will be 2710 kg per meter cube for inconel 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 is a very fascinating material in the industries so for inconel the density will be 8400 kg per meter cube then you have nickel for nickel the density will be 8900 kg per meter cube and finally i'll take the value of titanium the titanium density will be 45 20 kg per meter cube so if you observe carbon steel density is 7850 stainless steel density is 8000 means density of a stainless steel will be higher than carbon steel now density of inconel density of inconel is 8400 means density of inconel is greater than density of carbon steel and it is greater than the density of stainless steel also so density of inconel will be 8400 now if you see the density of nickel density of nickel is greater than the carbon steel stainless steel and inconel so density of nickel is 8900 so these are the densities hence if you have the density you can calculate the weight of any material now i'll give you a question and i'll expect you to solve that question i will simplify it everything for you so that you can easily solve on your own now your homework is you have to calculate the weight of a plate whose length is length is 5 meter width is 3 meter and thickness is 25 mm this is your homework you have to calculate the weight of this plate and the material of this plate is stainless steel so now you have to calculate the weight of this plate i'll just simplify it for you here you have length weight and thickness is given length is 3 length is 5 mm width is 3 mm thickness is 25 mm that you have to first you have to calculate the thickness 25 mm this is 25 mm so you have to, you have to calculate you have to convert the thickness into meter 
so 25 mm will be 25 by 1000 that is 0.025 meter so now you have converted all the units into meter so length is 5 meter width is 3 meter and thickness is 0.025 meter hence volume will be 5 that is length into volume is length into width into thickness so 5 into 3 into thickness is 0.025 so after solving this you will get the volume now the material is ss and as i told you earlier the main formula for calculating weight is v into rho v is the volume after calculating this you will get the volume and rho for a stainless steel is for a stainless steel the rho is 8000 8000 8000 kg per meter cube so this is the volume and this is the rho after multiplying this you will get the weight so friends i will expect you to calculate these and write in the comment box the weight of this plate if a plate is having length 5 meter width 3 meter and thickness 25 mm and that plate is made of ss what will be the weight that you have to write in the comment box friends hope you like this video thank you very much